Fortnite has a ton of glitches, and in this video, I'll be showing you a bunch of them. All these glitches are extremely fun to do with your friends, and they are very easy. Anyways, here are all the working glitches of 2019 in Fortnite Battle Royale. Welcome back to the channel, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far and in this video I'll be showing you guys a ton of new, easy and fun glitches for Fortnite 2019. These glitches all work on the Playstation 4, the Xbox One, the PC, the Nintendo Switch and the mobile devices. Now real quick, I'm providing my subscribers with free V-Bucks. I'm giving away a bunch of V-Bucks to my subscribers and you guys have a chance to win. To enter the giveaway, make sure to subscribe to my channel, drop a like on this video and also leave a comment down below telling me what console you play on. Anyways, the link to the giveaway will be down below in the description, so make sure to check that out. Now if you are going to enjoy the video, be sure to give the like down below and let's do another like goal on this video. You guys have been smashing these like goals every single time lately. Can we get 7,777 likes on this video? If we can reach that like goal, it would make my day and I hope this video does make your day. Now also, subscribe for more videos like these and by the way, I will be replying to each and every single comment down below in the comment section. And if you've turned on your notifications, be sure to comment hashtag notification squad and I will give your comment a heart. And if you don't believe me, try that yourself and your comment will get a heart. Anyways, let's get straight into this video. 2019 just started and since then, players have found a ton of glitches already. My goal is to show you at least one glitch in this video that you did not know about. Now one more thing, please do not use these glitches in public matches. If you do, you will probably get banned. So for your own safety, only use these glitches in playground with your friends. Now let's start with the first glitch. Alright, so the first glitch which I'm going to show you is going to allow you to emote while gliding. This only works when gliding down after dropping out of the battle bus. So, this will not work when you redeploy your glider or you take a launch pad. It looks extremely funny and everyone will be wondering how you did it. Anyways, to do this glitch, there's pretty much just one thing that you need to do. All you have to do is wait for the game to put you onto the start island and from there, once you see the countdown that says Battle Bus launching in 10 seconds, you want to select any mode that will repeat itself. So basically, any mode that will never stop. For example, the Boogie Down emote or the Electro Shuffle emote. Now just select the emote and stand still. From there, wait for the Battle Bus to take off and jump out. Now once you jump out, go ahead and deploy your glider and from there, the glitch should work. Now, the weird thing about this glitch is that you cannot see yourself doing the glitch. However, all the other players around you in your game can see you doing the glitch. As you can see, my friend is doing the glitch with me. I can see him doing it, but he cannot see himself doing it. Well, he sees me doing it and I don't see myself doing it. Anyways, it's a fun glitch and very simple at the same time. So, definitely give this a go. Then, for this next glitch, all you need is a plane. You can find the plane all across the map. So, that shouldn't be a problem. Now, once you got yourself a plane, make sure you have some materials and a couple of weapons to get the full experience of this glitch. Then, get over to this exact location right here on the map. It is over at Salty Springs. Then, once you're here, you want to hop into your plane and want to fly and crash into a specific tree. Somehow, by doing this, it will glitch the game and then when you exit the plane, you spawn under the map. To make this glitch easier, destroy all the threes around you, except for that one three of course. Then just get some speed and crash directly underneath the three, just like I did in the video or in the gameplay. From here, your plane should be stuck and if you then exit your plane, there will be an explosion, but you will actually drop under the map. From here, you can start to explore the map of Fortnite from below. While being under the map, you can do a lot of cool stuff by the way. You can still build, shoot and even destroy things. This is definitely a cool glitch and if you want to, you can hop onto a plane with all your friends and glitch underneath the map together. And so, have a lot of fun. Moving on to the third glitch of this video, we have an invisible plane glitch. This is definitely my favorite glitch of the year so far. Not only because it looks cool, but also because you can troll all your friends with it. It is hilarious. For this glitch, all you need is a pump shotgun, some wood and a plane. I recommend going over to this location over here at Lonely Lodge. Personally, I think this is the best spot to do it at. Now, once you arrive at this spot, all you need to do is get onto the plane as a passenger. 
you want to make sure you get onto the passenger seat on the left wing. And once you position yourself like this, go ahead and build a one by one around you of wooden walls. What should happen is the following. The left wing should be glitching through the wooden wall, actually halfway through. Once that is done, you're almost done with this glitch. You now have to aim just as I do in the video. So the bullets hit both the plane and the wooden wall. You should be doing the damage to the plane and to the wooden wall at the same time. And after about 6 or 7 shots, the wooden wall will get destroyed and the plane will glitch and get invisible. Now, once that happens, you have done the glitch. But make sure you do not leave the plane. If you do, you're going to mess up the glitch. So once the plane is invisible, you should still be on the left wing passenger seat. So just go ahead and switch over to the driver's seat and then you're ready for takeoff. Now the cool part about this glitch is that you can still use the machine gun as well as the boost. I know for a fact that players around you are not going to believe their eyes when they see you in an invisible plane. Just try this glitch and have some fun. From there we have glitch number 4, which is going to be a god mode glitch. You can pretty much stay up in the sky all game long with this. Once again for this glitch, you're going to need a couple of things. First of all, you need a plane, and then you need a couple of presents. Presents can be found in chests, llamas, supply drops, and this floor loot. So, you should find them easily. Now, once you have a plane and a couple of presents, go ahead and get some launch pads, mounted turrets, and bounce pads to make this glitch a lot more fun. Also, you do need a friend to do this glitch with, but that should not be a problem, I think. Just tell your friend to get into the plane and you want to sit on one of the wings. Once you did that, tell your friend to fly straight up into the sky and wait for both of you to reach a certain height. Then, once you're all the way up in the sky, fly straight up and once the plane is completely vertical, throw a present or gift against the middle of the plane. And you want to do this when the plane is starting to slow down. What then should happen is that the present will spawn up in the sky. Normally, this is not possible, as it's not directly connected to the ground, but somehow this will work. So from there, just try to land the plane onto the present or jump out of the plane and glide onto it. From here, you can make the platform bigger by throwing more presents against them. Just add presents to it. You can now stay up in the sky all game long. And you can even place launch pads, bounce pads and mounted turrets on top of them. Just make a base and have a lot of fun up there with all your friends. I really enjoyed this glitch and I think this is definitely the most fun glitch out there right now. From here, I'm going to show you a see-through buildings glitch. This can be very helpful when you don't know where the enemy is, and it just looks cool. In order to do it, all you have to do is start up any game, and as soon as you press the button to play, go over to your options and hover over the privacy settings. Then, just keep spamming down, and as soon as the loading screen pops up, you want to start spamming X for PlayStation or A for Xbox. Then, wait for the game to start, and you should notice that your entire game is glitched out. Everything should look a bit laggy and slow. And then, once you spawn into the game and you start building, you should notice that all your buildings will look like this. You can pretty much look through them. This is really weird, and I really don't know how this works. But it's working for me, and that's why you guys are here. Just use this in your advantage when fighting against all your friends and playground. Now moving on to the next glitch, it is going to be a boombox glitch, tip or trick, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, it is going to allow you to move the boombox with you wherever you want to go to. You can do this glitch with each and every single vehicle. So, with the quad crasher, the plane, the shopping cart, as well as the golf cart. Just get the vehicle you want to do this glitch with and also get yourself a boombox. Now, once you have those two things, get over to the vehicle that you're using and hop onto it as a passenger. Then, get out the boombox and throw it directly at the vehicle. Now, quickly exit the passenger seat and enter the driver's seat. Now, drive around while the boombox is activated. And then, you will see that you can now destroy all the structures and buildings around you and create some insane chaos. And then last, but not least, we have a completely invisible wall glitch. For this, all you need is a pump shotgun with a lot of ammo, some wood and some metal. And we're actually going to use the same method as with the invisible plane glitch, but a bit different. First, go ahead and place a metal wall and directly against it, place a wooden ramp or stairs. From here, get out your harvesting tool and hit the wooden stairs once. Then, position yourself just like this and get an angle where the red mark is placed on the metal, but the rectangle or the aim dot should be placed on the wooden ramp. Now start shooting and it'll damage both the ramp and the metal wall. Now eventually, the wooden ramp gets destroyed and the metal wall will turn completely invisible for everyone in your lobby. Now you can stand on it, throw all your friends and even place traps or bouncers against the invisible wall. 
Now, that was pretty much it for this glitch compilation. I can definitely make a part 2 of this video showing you even more glitches. So if you want that to happen, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Also, I do recommend turning on your notifications right now so you do not miss that out. However, I hope I showed you at least one glitch that you did not know about. And if I did, then I'm happy for now. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. But with all that being said, always remember, this was Shuffle Gamer, and I am signing out.